Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 6.0 video tutorial and in this video we are going to learn about the pagination. These are some key points that we are going to discuss through this video. So first of all we will learn what is the pagination, then we have to make a router and define the controller. After that we will pass the data to the view, write some code for pagination and add the style. Alright, so first question is what is the pagination? So when we have a, a long list of the uh, users or companies that we want to show on the page but uh, if this is in the thousands then we cannot show it on the single page so that we have to split the uh, number of rows to the different pages alright so then we you have to use the pagination and this is an example of the pagination when you click on the first then a limited amount of uh, companies or user will be shown the second and third and fourth alright so it will be nice to get the data from database as well as it will uh, user experience is also good so now let's start with the code. Uh, first of all, I'm just going to make a controller and the router. So just opening the control uh, command lines. Here I'm just going to make a controller. PHP artisan make controller and my controller name is companies. And I'm just going to hit the enter and now you can see that our uh, controller is created here uh, a function with the name of list is created here so that uh, we can get the data here and connection here so first of all I'm just going to write some dummy text alright and now I'm going to define the router for this uh, controller and uh, get and I'm just going to show it on the uh, list URL and let's uh, copy and paste it so that we can not miss every anything so sometime I just uh, really do the spell mistakes so that I just prefer the copy and paste the uh, big names and all alright so the router is ready so now I'm just going to check here with the list URL so let's put it here list so that's my bad yep actually my function name is not index it's in list so let's cross check it now we can see that the controller code is here so after that uh, I need to make a view so that I can just pass the data here so that I'm just going to inside the view and here I'm just going to write here uh, companies dot play dot php right uh, yeah I just made a make a misspell the companies here so yeah so this is the basic of uh, blade template and uh, now I'm just going to fetch the data and for the fetch the data I first of all I need to get the use of uh, database class so I'm just going to write here eliminate support and facet and my class name db which is help to me get get in touch with the database so dollar data will be take care of the data which is coming from the database db class table function and here i'm just going to put my table name and my table name is let's check it out with the php my admin and this is a uh, the company all right company table and here we can easily show the pagination because we have around lots of data around 20 so just put the table name here and now I'm just going to use the pagination method all right and in the pagination method I'm just going to pass the data that I want to catch up on the every page so first of all I want to sh put here 10 that means on every page 10 uh, data will be coming here all right and now let's just pass this data to the view so here I'm just going to write here view and here there's a 
it should be the two parameters one for the company and second one is the data which is come inside the array so here I'm just going to write here uh, data and it will come inside the data variable all right so now let's uh, go to the blade ph page and let's check first of all is it data coming or not so just right here print underscore r and let's check with the dollar data variable and now let's uh, try to run it okay so there is some issue let me check what is that uh, yeah this is not a pagination actually this is the paginate so I'm just going to replace it or now let's try now you can see that we got the data here okay so now let's convert this data to the pagination so I'm just coming back to the blade template not going here I'm not going to use the PHP tag I just use the blade template so first of all I'm just going to take a div here and inside the div I'm just going to write here for each loop so start with the for each and dollar data as dollar item will be come inside a loop and here I'm just going to use the end for each and between it I'm just going to use the li tag and here I'm just going to put here dollar item and here I'm just going to put here name alright so now I think pagination is ready so uh, let's see uh, actually pagination is not ready but list is ready now let's try now you can see that you got a small list but this is not all because uh, these are the 10 results only so how we can get on the next page for that we have to just a uh, list of uh, pages here number of pages so here I'm just going to make uh, another div here and inside this div I'm just going to simply write here dollar data and just write uh, put here links and this is a function so now let's run it now you can see that you got the pages here but these are not looking nice because uh, these are the uh, vertical way let's uh, put it in the horizontal way with uh, some style so I'm just going to use some style here and uh, as you see here we have a class name uh, with the page item so I'm just going to apply some style on it page item and here I'm just going to apply the two things one is display which is the uh, just we can simply write here inline block and padding is like uh, 10 pixel all right so just copy it from here and uh, simply paste it here and now let's simply check it out how it's working now you can see that this is looking nice and we can uh, just go to the front and back so but there is a two page only that how we can show the more pages uh, but we have only 20 data so I'm just going to be uh, limit of pages uh, limit of uh, number of item on a pages is four at a time so only four items on a one page will be going to show here you can see that we have a long list here okay so we can go forward and we can go backward here so this is uh, looking nice and here you can see the page number also so this is the all about the pagination if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box
don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks guys thanks for watching this video